Hey guys, all right, we are back, and this time we're with the uh, Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess game. I have never ever played this game, um, despite what you're about to see earlier, except for, you know, whatever, I had to test out the game, um, so I played for a little bit, and then I got kind of carried away, ended up playing about three hours. But other than those initial three hours, I haven't played this game. Um, so this is going to be new to me despite how old this game is we're going to be playing the gamecube version um because that's what i could get my hands on now um i've heard great things about this game i've heard this game is real good now we'll see how it compares or rather not compares but we'll see how it holds up seeing as how it is um the gamecube version so Let's go ahead and get started. Now, let's, all right, so that's the first save. We'll start a new one. Ignore that one. We'll go with, we'll actually properly case this one just so we know that it's a legitimate one. Ooh, here we go, and here we go, and here we go. Now, aside from those first three hours, again, that was just a test. I don't expect to be playing this game in advance and then coming back to, like, do the actual recordings. Um, so I probably won't. I'm not going to know the solutions to, you know, the puzzle, the dungeon puzzles. Or, like, where do I go next? Or what do I do? Who do I talk to? It's going to be completely blind. Now, I went back and forth on what to name the horse. I gave it a lot of thought. Um, now my initial thought was these nuts, right? These nuts. Because at the beginning they're like, oh, call these nuts and, you know, go get these nuts. And I thought it was hilarious. But that's not what we're going to stick with. We're going to go with my traditional name. Oh, no, this one is fine. I'm going to go with my traditional name for most of my pets in-game. Epone is a great name, not saying it isn't. But I'm just going to call my horse Taco. Don't ask me why. I don't have a reason. That's just what it is. Tell me. Do you ever feel a strange darkness at dusk as dusk falls? Oh, well, we're off to a great start. They say it's the only time when our world intersects with theirs. Who's theirs? The only time we can feel the lingering regrets of spirits who have left our world. So the spirit world? Look at this guy's mustache. I need a mustache like that. It's like almost a goatee. Uh, this is why loneliness always pervades the hour of twilight. That was in red. That's how you know it's important. But enough talk of sadness. I have a favor to ask of you, Swarly. That's me. That's me. I was supposed to deliver something to the royal family of Hyrule the day after tomorrow. Yes, it was a task set to me by the mayor. But would you go in my stead? Sure. So see why not. You have never been to Hyrule, right? Nope. In the kingdom of Hyrule, more red, more important, there's a great castle, and around it is Castle Town, a community far bigger than our little village, and far bigger than Hyrule is the rest of the world that God's created. Oh, you should look upon it all with your own eyes. Oh, so he wants to see the world. Thanks, guy. Is that our dad? It is getting late. We should head back to the village. I will talk to the mayor about this matter. Is that our dad? Is that supposed to be our dad? Is it like a creepy uncle? Well, that's creepy uncle, us, and Taco. Now, I'll be real with you guys, I don't know if Nintendo is or is not going to copyright strike me into the ground with this, so this may be the shortest series ever on the channel, but I really wanted to play this game, so I decided to give it a shot, um, and hopefully I don't 
get blipped off the earth or the face of the earth if you're talking well, let us know what he's saying mar, mar, mar. all right well whatever um yeah i hope to i hope to see this through my my plan is to see this from beginning to end maybe not 100 percent. i won't probably won't get all the hearts i won't find all the whatever's there are in this game to collect i don't know but i will see it through to the end provided i can make it that far hello kid he's kind of wearing like a burrito wrapping around his waist i don't know what that's about Who's that? Why'd they take our horse? Whoa. Hey, Swarly. You there? Maybe. Hey, you mind helping me herd the goats? Okay. They ain't listening to me lately. The goats. They don't speak English. Unless in this game they do. Do the goats speak English? Oh, man. I wasn't paying attention. Hey, where's Taco? See, that was one of the situations. Hey, where's these nuts? It would have been great, but we're going to go with Taco. Yo, what's up? Come on now, hurry up and bring Taco with you. From now on, just imagine it's saying what it's supposed to say. It's going to say Taco, but just... You keep it in mind. If you spot any particularly hilarious moments, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Alright, so so for this first area-ish, I kind of know what I'm doing. Because like I said, I did play this through um, just to test it out. Hello, girl, I don't know. Oh, hi, Swarly. Apparently you know me. I washed taco for you. Thanks. <laughs> uh, yeah, thanks. Oh, apparently, I have a crush on her. All right. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. What's up, girl? What's up? Taco is a girl, too. So you have to treat her nice like one. But listen, Swarly, could you do something for me? Can you use a piece of grass to play that song for me? You know. The one that Taco likes? This one. Yo, you mean this song? Oh yeah. Play with my tatted hand, you see that? What's up, Taco? Alright, what she said. It's such a nice melody. Taco looks happy. Well, she's all prettied up now, so I suppose you can ride her back, but don't make her do too much, okay? Sure, yeah, no problem. Oh, jeez. Come on. The horse is kind of clunky. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not trying to, you know, push off my shortcomings on the on the horse, but it is. Handles clunky. Let's get to the goat farm. Oh, look, it's everybody in town. We could stop and talk to them, but we have a job to do, so let's go do that job. You know, it makes me wonder, what was I doing before? Just chilling? Like, shouldn't I have been working? Also, long are the days of Ordon of of Lon Lon Range. It's Ordon Range now. What's up, my dude? Sorry to get you over here in such a hurry, Swirly. These guys have been awful skittish lately. They won't listen to a word I say. Sorry to ask, bud, but how about you and Taco hurt them? Into the barn. Oh, into the barn real quick. Listen. 
I got it. We can do this. I'll hurt him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Much obliged there, bud. Okay, then. Go on and hurt them all. Hurt on. Oh, my goodness. But go on and hurt all these little scamps into the barn for me. Let's, uh, start with you. Alright. We'll go around. Do one of these. Oh, that goat decided to go off into... Damn it, goat. There we go. Ah, uh, horse. You're supposed to turn real elegant-like. Ah. Uh, right. We're gonna get him. We're gonna get him. Nope, that way. It's not even a wall. You should be able to turn around there. Don't lie to me, horse. Get in, get in, get in. Alright, we got two. Okay. No, no, goat! Fuck off. Come at you this way. Right? Yeah. Oh no, oh no! Goat, no! Fuck you. Get in there, get in there. Garbage. Useless goat. Get in the get in the barn. Get in the barn. Alright, we got one in. Go on, go on. Get in get in uh, This is what are you miserable goat? Get in the Go. Go, 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 go. No, no. Yes. There we go. Now we got two left. Go, get in. Get in the damn barn. Go. There, we did it. Awesome. Twirly Taco, much obliged to both of y'all. I could cover everything tomorrow without having to trouble you, so just sit back and relax, bud. Alright, I guess we got a day off tomorrow. Oh, but how about today? Want to practice with the fences? Just wait a spell, bud. I'll get them fences up. Practice jumping? I'll get tired of riding. Just jump the gate and head back into the village, okay? Alright. Do a little, little round here. Here we go. Bam. Are you serious? Horse. There we go. I guess you have to be going at top speed. Here we go. Alright, let's get out of here. What's happening in town? Oh, yeah, absolutely. We'll save here. Nice. So like, today's our day off, right? Who the hell are these kids? Hey, wake up, Swirly. It's morning already. I don't want to. It's my day off. Go away. Damn kids. Neighborhood hoodlums. Apparently I have a burrito wrapping around my throat. I mean my throat. My waist as well. Can't do anything with that. I got a picture of goats. Oh, it's in my basement. Oh, it's just dark in here. Okay. So I'll have to come back later. So yeah, one thing about this game, the climbing is real slow. Heads up. So we have saddle. 
for our horse, our taco. What up, kids? Oh, Swarly, did you hear? They're selling a slingshot at the store right now. A slingshot. I wonder how powerful it is. I need. I must try it. Talo, if you and Mallow want it so badly, just buy it at my parents' shop. Do you see any rupees in my hand? I can't afford that thing. Come on, Beth. Can you just loan it to us for a while? You know I'd get in trouble, uh, get in trouble for that. If you two want it, save up your allowance or something. But our allowances are terrible. Oh, I wish I was born into a family with a slingshot instead of one with a water wheel. Alright, so you have the water wheel, kid. Alright, let's get out of here. Screw you, kids. Alright, we're in town. Chilling, chilling. Well, hey, morning, Swally. Got a day off from work today, my boy. Not me. The wife's been hassling me. Today's the day to restock our store. Look, see that up in that tree? You can get a better look at it by tilting the sticks and look around just by the way. Yeah, some Ordon bees built themselves a fine nest up there and I was thinking about knocking it down. Our cat hasn't come home since yesterday so the wife's in a bad mood. At the very least, I need to bring something home to her. Huh. Okay. Let's go in here. Just for a moment. Two little pixies. Hello. Oh. Oh. You alright? Oh my. It's young Swarly. Welcome, my dear. You. You didn't happen to see my little cat out there, did you? Nope. He ate the fish we were going to have for supper last night, and I gave him a good scolding. But then he went out and hasn't returned. I'm so fraught with worry for him. I'm exhausted. I've exhausted myself. Alright. Is that a picture of your cat right there? Alright, can't zoom in. Let's get out of here. Sorry, lady, I ain't seen your cat. I think you're screwed. Probably left. What's in here? It's locked. Okay, never mind. Hey, chicken. Come here, chicken. Chicken, come here. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yo, Swirly, yo. Up here. I want to talk to you. Press A while holding the things. Chicken. Hey, there you go. Over here. Yeah, your voice carries well, as usual. Maybe you can teach my tykes. You've got to press the buttons to talk to people from a distance. They don't get it. So listen, why don't you climb up those vines there, Swirly? I can do that. I can climb vines. Fine climbing. Yo, there you are. Check this out. You know Sarah at the general store? Well, isn't that her cat over there? I don't know. Her cat looked more black and white. Not black, orange and white, but I guess. He's just been sitting there next to my house having a staring contest with the creek. You don't suppose he's trying to... You don't suppose he's thinking he's gonna catch a fish do you ha 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 I can't can't catch no fish anyway that's not what I was meaning to tell you about I want you to take a look at something you see that grass growing back there on the edge of that rock haven't I seen you whistling into that stuff uh, is that a euphemism I figured it was pretty rare to see it growing in a place like that so I thought I'd let you know I bet you just hop across these rocks with just a little beep uh, couldn't you? Probably. Bam. I did it. Alright. Let's blow into those leaves. Oh boy. Uh, let's see. Can knock this down. I don't know that much. I don't know what else you're supposed to do with this eagle. Okay. If 
I remember correctly, we talked to... Oh, wait, I remember what we're supposed to do. Oh, um, good morning to you. If you're looking for my husband, he left his sword... He took his sword and left early this morning. But I must ask, Swarly, you have not seen a cradle come floating by here, have you? It is a baby's cradle made of finely woven tree bark. Oh, such a misfortune. How far could it have drifted, I wonder? Alright, so... She lost her cradle. And the water's flowing this way. So, do... Damn it. If we do one of these... No, oh, climb up. Come on. Alright. We see what looks like a monkey over there. Something in his hands. What could it be? Let's find out. <laughs> Come on, Eagle. All right. Well, looks like it's holding what appears to be a cradle. And it is! All right, we got it. That took me a little bit to fi figure out the first time. I can lie to you guys. So you're welcome for saving you all that time. The 20 or so minutes we would have wasted. Oh no, you don't. Oh, there we go. Oh, Swarly, that cradle. Did you go to the trouble of finding it for me? No, it just happened upon. Whatever. My thanks to you. Oh, that reminds me. There is something I'm supposed to give to you. Do you think you'd carry that cradle and come, uh, cradle and come with me back to my house? Uh, lady, you have a baby and you're pregnant. I don't know if you want to be cheating on your husband like that. Seems like a pretty good dude. Oh, come on. Oh, you gotta pick up the pace, woman. My thanks to you, Swarly. Yes, yes, I had nearly forgotten. I am supposed to give you this. Alright, here you go. Oh, I got a rod. Alright, face the water and use the cast. Press something something, but um something something. Alright. You can catch a fish with bait, but you need bigger bait. Got it. It is a little unpolished. My son, Colin Colin, made this under the instruction of his father. You can use it if you like. I do like. And I will use. You gotta be. Gotta be collecting money, by the way. Hey, nice. Make a little money. Make a little money. Yo, don't waste food. Shut up. Disrespect your environment. I'm gonna throw this pumpkin. Fight me. Fight me, old man. I am the legend man. I am the hero. I'll throw pumpkins all day if I want to. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Pumpkins. F you. What's in here? Oh, a dog. Hello, dog. Oh, that's cute. Hi, Swarly. Welcome. If you're looking for my hubby, he took a break from work and went outside. I wouldn't be surprised if he's taking a nap somewhere. He's in the middle of making a shield for Colin's dad, Russell, right at the moment. See it right over there, though it looks like it's far from being done. 
Sorry you came all this way to find him out and about. No problem. What do I do with this dog? Can I put this dog in the only? No. Is she gonna get mad at me if I smash her pumpkins? There we go. Got some money out of it. Can I take this dog outside? I mean, this is cute and everything, but... Alright, never mind. We're out. Bye, dog. I ain't got time to figure out where you want me to put you. Alright, so... Cat seems to be looking for a fish. Let's give it a fish. Okay, oh, come on. And we just pull back. Pretty much the easiest fishing. And we got it. Hey, 11 inches. These small fries are everywhere. Let's start to check the fish collection, blah, blah, blah. Alright, cool. And now we have the cat's attention. Back up, cat. I need space for my fishing. Fishing space. Come on, come on. And got it. Give me that fish. Give me the fish. Come on, come on. Yeah. Oh, 10 inches. All right, there you go, cat. Check my fish. did a thing. Let's get back over there and see what she has to say. Maybe she'll give us something. We got her cat back, right? Oh my Swarly, you said we must hear this. Just take a look, my little kitty my little kitty Swarly came back. And he brought a fish back with him. He was worried about me being angry. Oh, just look. Isn't he so cute the way he laps up that milk? Say, my dear, why don't you have some too? I'm in a good mood, so it's on the house today. Cool, leftover cat milk. Alright. Yeah. Let's get out of here. But it means we got a bottle, right? If we got a milk, we got a bottle. That's the way it works. Got ourselves some milk. Got ourselves some bottle. Speaking of which, let's uh nope. Oh. Let's make that an empty bottle real fast. There we go. You caught bee larvae in your bottle. Fish love them, and they're also edible and full of nutrients. Spade a rod, set your rod and larva to X and Y, and use the larva. So you can also eat them for nutrients, I guess. Get your life back. I want to try fishing with the larva. Something I didn't try. We're gonna catch a bigger fish right now, though. Damn it. Got one. Come on, bigger fish. Come on, come on. Oh man, that looks big. 13 inches. Small fries are everywhere. Set a new size record. The record of the size journal has been updated. Get the little guy. Let the little guy go with A. No. Why would I let it go? That's dumb. I want to keep it. I want to keep it so I can eat it. 
at least keep it so I can look I mean so I can hand it to this miserable ass guy. Swirly, I saw that. Calling down a hawk? Why didn't I think of that? I was trying to knock that down myself, but you beat me to it, my boy. Must be nice having bee larva. Well, I can give it to you. Uh. Ugh. I don't want to do that. Oh, bee larva. Must be nice. Damn, dude, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to give it to you. Alright, well. You're out of luck. Get your own jar. <clears throat> I'm sure your wife has more jars. Alright, so we're climbing up here because there's money up here. And we need money to buy that slingshot. <clears throat> Kind of small goings, I'm not gonna deny. Just carefully, there we go. Carefully. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Alright. Did a little shimmy, got a little gold, got a little money. Rubies, rupees, monies. Climb that, got it. Can we go in here? Hey? Oh, did you need Ilya for something? Sorry, Sonny, but I was told that if you came by today, I wasn't to let you inside. What? She locked herself in her room, working like crazy on something or other. Damn, but that's my girl right there. It's my day off. She doesn't want to chill. She doesn't want to... Whatever they do in Hyrule and chill. Morning Swirly sounds like Fatal's handling things at the ranch on his own today. When he's up there alone, I always figure some calamity or other is gonna happen. Whoa! A goat got loose. It's headed for town. Somebody stop it. I can do that. Come on, goat. Get fucked. Fuck you, goat. Yeah. Garbage ass goat. Ah, Fatal did it again. These ghosts have been awful skittish lately. You always gotta be on your toes. Sorry about that, Swally, but thanks to you, that goat didn't get away. Okay, let's go back to the shop. Hopefully we have enough for the slingshot, I'm not sure. I don't actually remember how much we need. Oh, uh, don't worry. You don't have to return the empty bottle, my dear. You can reuse it. You know, put something else in it. Recycling is a very important thing, my dear. I'm sure you'd never do anything of the sort, but these kids, uh, these... But kids these days toss things out like the whole world was disposable. It's criminal. So what do you say, my dear? Is there anything you want today? If you're interested, just take a look around with the thing. 30. Perfect. Buy it. What are you doing buying a slingshot, you naughty thing? You're too old for toys. Will you at least let the kids play with it? Oh, I should tell you, if you happen to run out of pellets, you can also use pumpkin seeds. You got the slingshot. Children love this item. You can hold up to 50 pellets. Set it to X or Y on the buttons. Alright, I don't need anything else. See you again soon. Set that to X, and we're good. Cool. See if those kids are super impressed with me and my slingshot. Hey, it's you, dude. What up? Ah, just in time, Swirly. I just delivered something to your room. Oh, I see you got the fishing rod. Colin will be pleased, and it works better than you would think, right? Well, have a good one. Okay, bye. Yo, Colin, what's up? 
Oh, you got it. I hope you like it. Aren't you off work today, Swarly? Yes, I am. Oh, shoot. What the hell is that? F you, spider. Let's get inside and see what he gave me. Hey, a chest. We're gonna get a thing. We got the thing. You got the wooden sword. Russell returned it after honing it for you. It's easy to use, just press B. Oh, we got it. Shoot. What up, kids? Swarly has a slingshot. Whoa! Wow, you had enough money to buy it, Swarly? Damn right I did. What's this? Preparations complete. Wow, okay, this is great. Let's see how powerful that slingshot is. Hit the targets and those scarecrows. I can't believe you two brats are so obsessed about this. It just shows that little boys, what little boys you both still are. These two idiots will never shut up about it, so I guess you'll just have to show them, Swarly. I'll oh, shut up, girl. You know you want to see this. Bam. That's amazing, Swarly. The slingshot manual said that it's easier to hit things if you hold the button uh, while you aim it. Did you call us obsessed with this thing? You're the one memorizing the manual. Bam. Do these. Oh, no, I missed. Oh, I missed. There we go. Got it. Damn it. There we go. And got it. Bam. Whoa, amazing swirly. Yeah! Thanks, Swirly. That one kid on the right. His mouth was open the whole time. Flies could live in there. <laughs> Gee, you really are amazing, Swirly. Damn right. Yeah, you are. And you use swords and slingshots and everything. Hey, yeah, that reminds me. You've got to teach us how to use a sword, too. Seriously, lately these monkeys have been coming out of the woods and playing tricks on us. We want to get them good. Come on, teach us how to use a sword. Probably shouldn't it? But I do it. You heard him, he's excited. Some sword things. Alright, first off, we want to see that move. The slice. Uh, you just swing with B, right? Just swing it with B. Bam. Yeah, a vertical slice. Was that it? Was it? I've definitely seen you do a horizontal slice before, you know, where you just press B. Alright, next. Oh, oh, I want to see that other move, Swirly. Yeah, the one where you just tilt the buttons and press B to flex your muscles and stab. Oh, please, the stab. That kid. Side eye and me, kid. Bam. How about that? Oh, Swirly, just amazing. Since you're at it, how about you show us that other move? You know, that little twirly thing you do? I love that. What do you call it? A spin attack? Like it's hard to briefly hold B and release it. Fuck you, kid. I don't see you doing nothing. Oh wow, thanks, Swarly. I'm sorry you have to waste your time with these little brats when you must be tired from doing all the important stuff you do. Stop trying to hit on me, girl. You're like eight. You've got to show us the jump attack before you go. You know, the one where you go, hey ya, and leap through the air. Uh huh, uh huh. Screw you, little kid. Oh, yeah. See? Blew your mind. You didn't even know. You didn't even know you wanted to see that before I showed it to you. Thanks, Warly. So, uh, I think I get it. Kinda. Maybe not. So, this means that anytime one of those naughty monkeys shows up, what? 
Shit, it's a naughty monkey. Got like a rose or a hat on it. Come here, you. Alright. Let's go. Gotta go get those kids. Nope, no kids? Alright. Here we go. Crossing the bridge. Gotta save you, kid. I'll save you. Fair and Woods. Who's this kid? Let's get off the horse. Go this way because I kind of know we need to go here first. What's up, Afro man? Whoa, an Ardonian. Hey, guy. Listen, I'm not sure you should be wandering around the woods without a lantern. Just because it's daylight doesn't mean it's safe. There are a ton of caves and dank spots around here that get pretty dark even in the middle of the day. Yeah, so dank. Here, go on, take this. Lantern. Awesome. This is a must for lighting dark places. Set it to the buttons. Use it once to light it and press the thing to the thing. You won't be able to use it without oil, so make sure to refill it. See, I sell lantern oil here. I'm trying to drum up sales by giving away free lanterns. It's a business tactic, guy. See, as long as you've got oil to fuel your lantern, you can light your way and set fire to stuff. They're the best. Go on, guy. Try setting a fire under that big pot. That's right, see? It's on fire, guy. Yeah, you keep using that lantern anytime you feel the need. And if it runs out of oil, you come see me and get it refilled. Yeah. Oh no. Come on, man. Just move where I can fill either your lantern or an empty bottle. Nah, I'm good. You keep using that lantern. If it runs out of oil, come see me, guy. There's a really dark cave that way. You can get used to... You can get some use out of your lantern there for sure. We'll do that. Put it away for now. I don't waste any oil. Relax, boys. What's up? Oh, damn. Got him. Stick. You find a play wooden sword. It's Talos. You. Nope. Go back. Damn keys. Like you. <laughs> Get out of Put that away. Oh, is that a rat? Gross. What is over here? Get stabbed. Awesome, got him. What's in here? Oh yeah, ten rupees. Cool. Oh, that's not that big of a cave. I've seen bigger. Oh, oh, come on. Ah. 
Got him. Let's get to this area real quick. Look a right right here. Nope. Close off, keys. I don't want anything to do with you. And whack. Whack, whack, whack. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, I want that though. Got it. Light you. And light you. Oh, a thing. Secret thing. Alright, what's in here? Nice, small key. Very important. Gonna need those. Oh, come on. Open the chest. The chest, I say. Hey. Five pieces. Ugh. Number four pieces. Back in I back in my day, we got four pieces. Nope. Go away. Get juked. Go this way. Roll, no. limp bisque in it. There, got him. More of you guys. Buzz off. I'm trying to save these kids, not do whatever you want me to do over here. Oh. <gasps> the kid. Oh, and the monkey. What irony. You're going to beat the shit out of that monkey, and now you're trapped in a cage with it. Surprise that monkey didn't tear your face off. Monkeys are crazy strong. Especially when they're mad. And whack. Yeah. What's up? I get you out of there. Nice. You're free. What up, kid? If you hadn't come, Swarly, gee, me and that monkey would have probably gotten eaten. Probably. She's actually a pretty nice gal, that monkey. She tried to protect me, so we got captured together. Um, Swarly, you're not going to mention this to my dad, are you? You're always telling me, he's always telling me to never, ever go into the forest, because he says it's dangerous. So you really can't tell him, really. You have to promise. I ain't promising nothing. I ain't a liar. It comes to me, I'll tell him. Swarly. Yo, what's up? Are you that kid's dad? That motherfucker was in the forest. My son told me Tallow disappeared into the woods and had not returned. I came soon as I heard. But it looks like you have brought him home already. I apologize. Such a task should not fall to you. Tell me, have you mentioned... Have you noticed how strange the woods seems lately? I feel uneasy about what may lie in wait. Anyway, Swarly... Tomorrow is finally the day you will be departing for Hyrule. Yay! I think it's a good thing I have given this task to you. Good luck and return safely. If you are lucky, you may even meet Princess Zelda. Ha 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 ha. cool joke on me? Saying I'm not going to meet Princess Zelda? That's not nice. Oh yeah, we're just chilling. Hey, Swarly, what up? What's up, my man? My goat man? 
A goat? Goat's turn? So, anytime. Almost time for you to get going, huh, Swarly? So, how about we finish up early today, bud? Okay. Need my horse? Horse time. Oh, we have to hoard these goats again? Fuck. I don't want to do that. I don't want to hoard my goats. Or herd the goats. I was first. Okay then, let's get started. Damn it. Alright, we're gonna start by getting these closer. I imagine this is exactly what herding actual goats is like in the real world. Go goats. Oh wow. I didn't even do anything to those goats. Go goat. Oh, yeah, we got a couple more goats in. Let's go slightly better than last time, if, not, if only slightly. I'll take slightly. Damn, racking up the goats in. Get in there, goat. Oh, another goat. Shit. Go on, goat. Go on. Get in the barn. Get in the barn. Boom, boom. More goats. More goats. What about you goats? No, no, don't you even dare go away. Go in the f you go in the barn. Go. What goat? Oh you can murder you. I'll murder you goat. Turn you into upholstery. Turn you to decorations. Don't even play with me, goat. I will make you into goat steak or whatever they make out of goats not lamb chops goat chops I'll make you into goat chops goat don't even oh you too you wanna be goat chops get in there there boom all oh, you goats get in there get in there get in there yeah that's right goat master much better than the first time I think oh boy but y'all can hear that was one minute and eleven times faster than usual. I mean than last time. Well that about wraps up wraps her up for today, so how about y'all head on over to the mayor's place? Let's go to the mayor's place. Let's do a little a little round here. Bam. Oh yeah. Do -do -do -do. Nice. All right, we're good. Peace. Later, goat man. I got an important thing to do in high rule. Enjoy those goats. I'm out of peace. Moving up to the big time, big city boy now. Hey, what up, girl? Yeah, that's right. Coming in. Long day of herding goats. He's got like goat horns himself, almost. I know it's a mustache, but it looks like face horns. Tusks. Oh, done hurting for the day, Swarly? Well, nice work. Thanks. The royal gift Russell told us about is ready, so you should get ready for your trip to Hyrule Castle. Now, the royal family requested this gift specifically, so it's real special. It'd be bad if the representative of Ordon were to be late for such an occasion. You get me, lad? The path before you is a long one, my sweet horse, but please bear Swarly safely along along it. Wait, what's this? What's happened? She's injured, isn't she? What? When? Swarly, how could you? You were pushing Taco too hard again. I bet you heard her leg jumping fences, didn't you? I mean, I had to jump a fence to get out of the farm. Now, now, Ilya, there's no... Oh, never mind. Father. She's pissed. How can you be so easy on him? You're the mayor. You should start acting like one. Damn. Get ripped. You poor thing. It'll be alright, Taco. I'll take you to the forest spring right now. 
Once we soothe you in the spirit spring, you'll feel better in no time. What about me? I want to be in the spring. Wait, Ilya. Why, without Taco, the gift won't get delivered in time. Oh, this won't do. Also, I, I should probably use a bath. I could probably use a bath myself. Alright. Let's see. Talk to you. Hey, you almost hit me with that sword. I saw you. The time has come. Well, Swarly, can I at least interest you in one serious sword lesson? Once you return from Hyrule? Yeah, dude. You have talent with a blade if you were able to get proper instruction I bet you could be a very skilled swordsman you can't you can let me know once you return but I want you I want you to give it some serious consideration yeah dude we can sword fight right now let's go back to the town yeah or not the town to our house I want to see what's in our basement I want to find out. Oh. Swarly. Are you going to see Ilya? Maybe it's just me. But those guys don't normally let people through. Um, Swarly, you think... You think we can go see her together? Uh, sure. But I'm going to my basement first. So, you better chill. What up, girl? Swarly. Hello again. Oh, oh. You're going to Hyrule Castle, aren't you? That must be so nice. I want to go to Hyrule, too. I mean, there's nothing that looks good on me in this town. I don't know. That burrito wrap looks pretty cool. Then again, it is the fashion of this town, apparently. Everybody wraps himself up in this. I keep calling it a burrito wrap, but it's like a if you took like a hand towel and wrapped it around you long ways. With like a, I don't know, a belt. It's in my basement. Hey, a chest. What's up? Nice, 50 rupees. Oh, we should, hold on, I don't want to waste oil. So let me put that away. All right, we're rich now, we got 50 rupees. Shit. We're sitting on a gold mine. There I was throwing pumpkins like an idiot. I was sitting on 50 rupees. Damn. What a fool. <clears throat> what? Hey, we've been waiting for you, you know, Swarly? Yesterday was so much fun. Yeah, chasing that monkey was great. What about the getting caught and all that other shit? I was just telling Mallow here about how we wanted how we wanted to show it to him but we let it go instead that's lies oh you didn't get caught Talo? look at you calling any bullshit way to spoil everything by telling your dad nice job yeah thanks a lot we got scolded by our dad something awful I thought it was never gonna end fuck you how about you don't get fucking caught I bet you're trying to go see Ilya now aren't you well there's no way I'm gonna let you pass oh hey neat Swarly let me borrow that wooden sword. If I had had that wooden sword yesterday, I could have handled it all alone, definitely. Dude, you had a sword. Alright, fine, whatever. Take the damn sword, I don't care. Just shut up. You're the worst. Uh-huh, whatever. With this thing, I'll show him. Sure, whatever. Get out of my face. Little ingrate. Hope you get hurt. Yeah, no problem. Those guys are always teasing me. What's so fun about swinging something like that around anyway? I hate it. It's scary. But when I grow up, I'm gonna be just like you, Swarly. No, you're not. I'm swinging swords all day. I don't want to learn anything about swords. I don't want to learn about swords or anything, but could you teach me how to ride a horse sometime? Alright, that's different. I'll teach you how to ride a horse.
So we're just gonna... Okay, you gonna run ahead without me? You wanted to go see her together, not alone. Let's go to that spring. Girl, what's up? Oh, man, what? Are you serious? Swarly. If you came to take Taco back, you can forget it. Why do you think about what you've done for a change? I won't open the gate until you change your attitude. Ilya, you don't know what happened yesterday. Listen, I don't know if she'll listen to me, but let me try to explain about Tallow and the monkey, okay? You crawl in here through the tunnel in the back while I do. Alright. We'll call him. We'll crawl in that back tunnel. Do a little roundabout. Roundabout tunnel crawling. I'll get a horseback. That's what I want.